Welcome to the business segment. Now, human resource professionals have been advised to reposition themselves in order to adapt to the changing times of the world. According to economist Al-Hassan Andani, it's about time HR professionals ripped the old manuals and created new ones to suit the agile form of work. Speaking to Joy Business after the launch of the third cohort of the Irene Asari HR mentoring program, he applauded the team for actualizing the dream of mentorship. Rip the old manuals and write your book. That's the advice from economist and former chief executive of Stambic Bank, Alhassan Andani, to human resource managers. According to him, since COVID-19 pandemic has altered work habits across the globe, it's time for HR practitioners to create new paths to remain relevant. We can no longer operate on those old HR manuals. We've got to rip them off and then rethink and write a new uh, manual for the new work, world of work. Because a new world of work is a totally different game. Organizations are going to be radically different. They are going to be very agile, changing. Their purpose might be the same, but the way they get it done will change very rapidly. So it's no longer the stable, predictable environment as old HR practices were you know, written for. So we now need to look at HR management practices that you know, looks to the nature of organizations and by nature of the organizations, the kind of skill sets that are required to make those organizations uh, profitable or sustainable. Meanwhile, founder of Kevin Clay People Development, Irene Asari, says the Irene Asari HR mentoring program seeks to help HR professionals learn best ways to ensure productivity in their various places. She indicates that this third cohort is of great importance especially during the pandemic where hybrid work has come to stay. Hybrid working is our reality. We thought initially it would be the new normal and it would go away, but it's here to stay. And I think what that means for us as HR professionals is we have to learn to adapt. We need to learn to think differently. What COVID has taught us is that the world as we saw it and as we know it has completely changed. And therefore, what does that mean for us as practitioners? If, for example, we have individuals that are working from home, individuals that are coming into the office, we're giving people more choice. How do we still continue to nurture the culture? How do we still continue to drive productivity? What kind of policies, processes, systems, ways of working do we now need to design that was different to what we were doing before? So this is the moment that us as HR professionals really need to step up to the table. One of the mentees, Patrick Siame, who is the human capital business partner with Stambic Bank, expressed his delight to be part of the program to learn from household names in the sector. This is very much uh, important for the human capital community and very much excited that uh, we have people in this country like Irene Asari, who is very seasoned or experienced HR person, to put this program together to develop you know, the people who drive this change that would change our economy, that would actually take our businesses to the next level. And um, the more exciting aspect is to have um, seasoned HC or human capital practitioners in this country who have volunteered their time you know, to kind of groom the next level of human uh, resource or human capital individual who drive this change and change the economy of this country. From business, we take you to sports after the break.